Morocco, the land of colorful spices, beautiful architecture, vibrant cities, orange juice, mint tea and incredible craftworks. Despite all its fantastic features, a lot of people still think it is a dangerous country to visit, especially for female solo travelers. I traveled solo in Morocco for two weeks to find out what it's really like. This is my story. right now and I am in a typical Berber pharmacy and it looks gorgeous look at all the colors of the spices and the ceiling and they are going to give me a demonstration about argan oil and I, they already put something on my hand and it's so soft it doesn't smell at all but this really is a gorgeous gorgeous pharmacy <laughs> mm, it's really good. Yeah. <laughs> Minta and lavender. Nigel is this one. This is Nigel seeds. This is lavender. This is Minta. And this is Camomile flower. It's Camomile flower. <laughs> I am making and argan oil at the moment. What's in my paper? Wow. It's a cool place here. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? This is argan oil. Argan oil. Yes, for wow. Your skin. Ah. It's very good for your skin. It wow. Gets soft. Mm, it's good. Do you use the creams directly for skin? Yes. Ah, <laughs> directly use it. Sprinkle and it cleans. It's good for your health. Ah, use it. <laughs>
just arrived in Palais Seban in Marrakech. It is my second place to stay here in this city and it is gorgeous. Look at all the details and the pool. Unfortunately, it's raining today, so but tomorrow there will be sun, so it will be a completely different sight and I can't wait to take pictures here. I already met the manager and she's so so nice. So, so lucky being able to stay here. Um, look at that. There's a pool, there's like a patio. It is just amazing. And I can't wait spending my days here. Unfortunately, the sun still isn't shining, but that's okay. I'm mentioning that a lot because it isn't normal, this weather here. But tomorrow, there will be sunshine.